Well, there's, there are too much to mention, but if I can only mention one, so I guess that's the news that um, Swift has succeeded in connecting Singapore, Australia and Europe and is now being able to do a payments transfer in less than a minute. So that's one of the biggest things. One of the other things I'd like to mention is the cloud offering that is uh, happening. The other one is, of course, KYC. KYC is everywhere. So those are three really hot topics that we're seeing today. So as ING, we're not talking about products, we're talking about our clients here. Um, and I guess what is the most important development that we're looking at is the start of open banking. With uh, the payment service directive now in place for us everywhere across Europe, we're now open for business with APIs. Yeah, that's a very good question. Um, what do we expect uh, for next year is first of all, they will, they will continue to build on open banking. That is, that is what, that, that will go on. Instant payments, we expect that to be, uh, let's say, coming to the market everywhere in, uh, in the world. And KYC remains one of the biggest things, regulatory compliance. And I guess fraud and cybersecurity, that remain the important, uh, important themes. Next to, of course, fintechs, big techs entering to the market. So a number of things at the same time, and that in relatively volatile worlds, uh, where we deal with geopolitical uncertainty, trade wars or technology wars, I guess that sums it up as a, as a whole.